Welcome back. Oh, we are not moving. So we just watched a few Wendigos go edit. And today this ends. Oh my god, it's getting close. I can't talk right now, guys. Yeah, it, it was getting close. Be strong. You did it. You done did it. Oh my god, could this go Hey! Ice? Chris made it. So you got one. Okay. Oh no. Don't. No. Oh, why? Why uh. did you tell me don't? Oh, I didn't know there was one so close. Because uh, you did what literally everyone does the first time. Instead of saving Mike. Oh, that doesn't save him, does it? He else. dies. Yeah. So I saved Chris. Oh, boy. That's unfortunate. And it was the one time I tried to help you, too. Yeah, but you shouldn't have. Why? Because. This is how, this is what I deserve. <laughs> you already fucked it up. It's fine. Great. I knew it, too. As soon as I did it, I was like, wait, awesome. there's no way they're going to be able to get out. Great. That's, um, that's it. You know, I'm kind of okay with that. Sorry to anyone who joined us for this journey. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. I, I saved two of them, so. <laughs> you saved Sam and Chris. Yeah, and I like them. Fuck. No. Oh. Oh, okay. I guess you're not hard to satisfy. It was a good game. I can't be mad. I made the decisions. This oh, is what I, 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 I... I'm dying inside. That was bad. You killed Ashley. I'm sorry. You killed Mike. You I'm killed very Mike. sorry. Emily. Okay. I mean, Emily okay, could kiss my fucking ass because she pushed Ashley and that was just mean. And... That is the one thing I wanted to say. I don't appreciate about this game. <laughs> what? Oh. Literally that one decision. I feel oh, like it's worded to of... fuck you. Because you're scared to move, of course. And when it says run to switch, you aren't thinking she's going to go run and fucking blow yeah, everyone up. don't think you're going to make it, You don't honestly. think you're choosing that. Okay, so, let's listen. Uh, the old man, I... Uh I, I don't know how to describe him, I mean... You said you thought he was stalking you at first. Did anyone else in your group think that? Well, yeah. We, <laughs> Is it possible they could have killed him? What? No. No, you, you, you don't understand. Don't you understand? And if he attacked you... He saved my life. And I watched him die. I thought we were close. After his sister's disappeared, he'd come and talk to me. He said I was the only one who understood him. I thought... I thought we had a connection. If you need someone to talk to... I'm fine. Sometimes, after a traumatic experience... I said I'm fine. It was my fault Mike died. I wasn't supposed to move, but I did. Not just Mike. And he saved me. So it's my fault that he died. You need to listen to me. I don't care if you believe me or not. It doesn't matter because you will. You need to go down to the mines. What's in the mines, or not. Sam? I've seen what's down there. Not give anything to unsee it. Nice question, dodging Sam. <laughs> That's politics. Well, shit. So, depending on who lives, they each have a part after that, I'm assuming. Like yeah. Like with the police. Uh huh. I do miss Mike. Yeah. So, what? Uh, Ashley? Whatever. I do miss Mike. I do miss Mike. Eat me. You um, review, please? but so if you, uh, run to him, what happens in that? See, so it's the most straightforward the game's literally ever been. It's like, Hey, save Mike <laughs> or run to the switch. 
Yeah, but if you save, so it actually means like, yeah, but like you're running towards him. So either way, there's those things in both directions. Yeah. But that actually meant what it meant then, like save Mike. You're actually going to save Mike, not you're going to try. And then there's another option, try and save Mike again. Um, You know what I mean? Like how we did that with Emily, like save Emily, save Emily. move, but then you have another don't move sequence. So like you do it and then you stop, then you do it and you stop and you slowly get everyone out. Um, Yeah. One by one. Or there's the option to blow up the entire cottage prematurely, (laughs) which I, again, I fucking hate that because of how it's worded. I feel like if you just worded that differently somehow, I don't even know what Mm -hmm. I would write differently, but all I know (laughs) is... Right, flip the switch and blow up the whole house, (laughs) and then maybe you'll go to save Mike. Blow up house. Like, (laughs) I don't know. All I know is when I first played, I did that. When, that makes me feel better. <laughs> when uh, I believe Anza did that. I believe Skylar did that. I mm-hmm. believe everyone I've seen fucking did that. Well, because that seems like the choice. Yeah. Like, flip the switch and then it's a, like, you did it. Yeah. I, just, I don't know what exactly they could have done differently. Like, And also, everyone I've seen finish this game it was immediately was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. Turned this shit off, restarted it, and got the right ending. But, yeah, you're, you're pretty chill about it. It's because I feel like, like the decision I made, apparently I deserve that <laughs> because of uh, that's just how it was, I guess. Yeah, I guess that's not so, wrong. But, like... Like, it's not that, like, I'm either, like, yeah, hard to like please or easy to please. It's, like, that's literally how the game works, and I made that decision, and I fucked up. Yeah, so like <laughs> I said, I feel like that for most of this game. Like, I'm like, I like that... You might think you're making one choice, but it's fucking over when you're making the wrong one. Right. And with that like pisses the butterfly. A lot of, that pisses a lot of people off. I don't know if I said that on here or if I said that to you off camera. I think we were talking about it this morning. Yeah. I don't even remember if that was recorded or not, but th- yeah, I know a lot of people are upset by that. Not me. Like I, I like that you can try to save Emily and in turn get her killed. I like that because mm-hmm. it's kind of realistic. Like it in- is intentions aren't always they don't always give you the outcome you're going for right right it's just like in the moment that's good but then later on like five minutes later well since you saved her she's gonna die anyways yeah so i disagree with a lot of people on that i like that about this yeah yeah but but i do have some beef with that last one because i feel like you're not making the choice you think you're making even on like no yeah even at the basic text level it's like you think you're doing something else yeah Yes, you aren't thinking, I can agree with I'm that wholeheartedly. To, yeah, yeah, because if your thought, like, if you knew, like, yeah, your thoughts not like, hey, see, let me blow up the house and save myself, because yeah. that wasn't my, like the intention at all. You see, save Mike, and you're like, well, a window's gonna get me. <laughs> like, That's the, what I thought. I didn't know it was gonna end so quick, <laughs> and it did. That was it. Yeah, like, I didn't. Re- I didn't realize that was it. You're like, okay, well, the game has been telling me not to move. Right. Yeah. And I know if I run to the switch, that's my way out. Like you're thinking, oh, everyone else will get out. Like right, for some exactly. reason, it's like, like oh, well, since I got Sam out, then they're gonna transfer me to the next character, and then I'm gonna be able to still help from inside. Yeah, it just cl- it clicks in your mind. And also, one more thing, um, since uh, just like a fun fact, <laughs> since Chris got to chapter ten, he couldn't have died. He's the only character that can't die in chapter ten. Oh, yeah. So well, I wish I would have known that, cause then I wouldn't have worried about <laughs> been trying so hard. Well, you don't play as him in chapter ten either. It's just he's always the first one out of the house in that last scene. Oh, like so that's scripted. Yeah. Then, no matter what, he just runs out. Yeah. So. Yeah. Wow. So you saved Chris and Sam. On my first playthrough, the only one who died was Matt. Are you fucking kidding? Well, me? except I did this. I did this. So like, I wouldn't wait. Even count so if that. you only kill no, so like what I did was I immediately shut it off and turned it back on. So technically, the only ones who lived would have been Jessica and Chris and Sam. Technically, but I shut it off and turned it back on, and the only you know I redid that little part, <laughs> and yeah. then Matt was the only one who died. Like for you, 
I would say the only people you got killed were Matt and Jessica. Oh, yeah. Jessica, I fucked up real bad because I completely forgot about the not moving. Because that little <laughs> end sequence, I, it's, it's bullshit, in my opinion. Because, I don't know. Everyone just wants to choose that. So, I've seen it happen enough where I'm like, maybe the game should have figured out how to put that better. Right. I'm not just mad my about opinion. It. Just I my like opinion. this game yeah. a lot. I'm I'm it's I'm one not of my favorite happy. games, yeah. I'm not happy with the outcome, but I'm happy that I got to experience Yeah. it in that way, I guess. Yeah. So So for you I would say you survive like six or five of them because I guess Josh Yeah, cuz I think it, in the end that last sequence it's like Yeah. So I would say you So I, I Sam yeah. Chris uh emily, ashley, ashley, ashley emily and mike yeah that's what i would but i'll put that in my brain <laughs> i saved five of them <laughs> i'm fine with that that's good like if you restarted it right now and redid that last part then that's what you would have right so. okay so on your actual journey you fucked up and lost matt and jess yeah which apparently i feel like everyone would lose matt though that's what i'm saying yeah the game thinks the easiest person to lose is jess there's actually a trophy you get for the only her. the only person of the whole group that you specifically get a trophy for keeping them alive is jess because apparently she's supposed to be the hardest one to keep alive i think matt's the hardest to keep alive i feel like the way that also because matt can be in that final sequence with jess as you saw right if you it can end up being matt and jess yeah so I find him. Well, the then hardest. you would you would think though if they can both be at the same place in the same time at the same time, that they would both be equally just as hard to keep alive. Yeah. Because if Matt's not there, right? Yeah. Then Jessica know. doesn't. And th- th- did the game obvious like honestly not obvious? <laughs> did the game honestly not think people would try to save Emily twice? Like, yeah, she's a bitch, but we're not going to try and kill her. Yeah, but I don't want to <laughs> kill anybody. Yeah, exactly. I mean, there's some people like, I mean, if you're mm-hmm. going to like, definitely if I played this again, I'd be like, all right. I want to kill everyone. Let her go. Like, I don't, well, I don't want to kill oh, anyone, yeah. but I would make different decisions. I'd be like, my intention for this isn't to kill the characters, just to see what the outcome is. Yeah, well, there's, there's like people who definitely run through this game and they're like, I want to make sure everyone dies. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, there's actually a trophy for it. If you kill everyone? There's like, I got, I 100% of this. I already said that. So I had to, there's one for keeping all the guys alive, one for keeping all the girls alive. There's one for keeping them all alive, one for just keeping Jess alive. And there's one for killing them all also. And like everything in between. There's one for shooting Emily in the face. Oh my God. Yeah. I should have done it. Shoulda. But anyway, anyway, that's uh, not that important, I guess. So, your review, you uh, I loved it. You loved it. Yeah, oh, it was cool. great. <laughs> Me too. I like the the whole like the the butterfly effect and mm-hmm. how it tells you too. I think that's also an interesting um concept Mechanic? of the game as yeah. well that it actually lets you know that like. You know, you're not just making decisions and then here's the end of the game. It's like you made this decision and then this is why that happened. Yeah. And I think it's nice that it tells you that and it gives you like a visual. Yeah. And I I still think it does it better than a lot of games where your decisions ultimately don't really matter. Right. You're just making them and no matter what, it's still kind of scripted in that way. Like in Life is Strange, like the last decision, it, it, it comes to like no matter what you choose... It comes to a final decision. Right. And it's like, well, okay. <laughs> so everything I did up until now kind yeah, of changed it didn't the journey, even matter. but it doesn't matter. Like, right. No matter what, I yeah. only have these two options anyways, so. Yeah. And that's for the for the before the storm, too. Mm-hmm. Um, but I feel like this game, you really feel it because everyone who you work to keep alive will be alive at the end yeah or if you killed them then it sucks it's like shit they're gone. yeah it's like fuck how long did i spend on this yeah which is is again the reason the end bothers me so much because you've worked so hard and then that one decision always throws everybody off yeah but whatever i enjoyed it's it. still like one of my favorite games of all time if not my favorite game yeah no it's a i 
I would put it up there. Yeah. If so, I had played more than like 10 games in my whole life. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just really glad we got to do this on the channel mm-hmm. at all. Because I wasn't going to be able to do it with Anza or Skylar, obviously. Yeah. Thanks for choosing me. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm glad I could get some <laughs> poofed. Yeah. And, uh, it was in good there. to have a whole <laughs> series with um throwing the controller. <laughs> God damn. <sighs> well, that was fun. Yeah. Until next time. Yeah, I hope you guys uh hope you guys enjoyed the series if you watched it. Yeah. And uh <laughs> you probably just as let and down please, by the end as yeah, I am. And please don't hate me. <laughs> yeah. Um uh there won't be any redemption for this i know a lot of youtubers when they finish this and fucked up they'd go and do a redemption run we, we don't have time to do we that we don't have time and i'm okay with what happened okay in a non sadistic way yeah <laughs> so uh thank you for watching and um uh, that sucked <laughs> thanks <laughs> we'll see you in the next series and thank you bond for joining us oh thank you for having me it was a pleasure <laughs>